Adonai, Barach Nuchem Bet Adonai. Blessed are you who come here in the name of God. We bless you in this house of God. What an exquisite house of God we are in. To be in this beautiful place surrounded with these beautiful people. We feel the presence of eternity around us. And we pray that you feel the presence of all of your friends, your family, all who are gathered with you to celebrate this beautiful day. Allison and Keith, the wind is blowing, but nothing, not a pandemic, not changed time, not changed venue, all of the work that has gone into getting us to this day, nothing can keep you from this day. You stand here in this beautiful presence, in this place of sacredness. It has been a difficult journey, but you have continued to walk this journey as you are right now, hand in hand. You've created a new life for yourselves in Denver. You've had the pandemic puppy, all the things that are important during this time. As we are reflecting on our past and dreaming about our future, we are returning. And our prayer is, as you take these first steps together as husband and wife, that you will return to the core of what brought you to this place. takes us, you will always have each other. Our prayer is that the cup of your life will always be filled to the brim and that you will always share in great joy together.
enjoyed our list of very special in-laws. The Wolf family, the Rothstein family, and now all the Newmans. We've done so much legwork to get this done, and we're just so looking forward to the future. In conclusion, I just want to say this gorgeous wedding takes place just after Rosh Hashanah, the beginning of the Jewish New Year. The New Year is a time of unlimited possibilities, so fitting for celebrating a beautiful young couple beginning a life together. May we all be inscribed in the Book of Life. May this New Year be a healthy and happy one for all of us. And please raise a glass to toast the bride and groom. We wish you everlasting love, good health, and long life. So, fortunately, these two were meant to be the sheriff, as we would call it, and fate was on their side. And before we even concoct this covert scheme to connect them, um, one coffee meant another bagel, and the rest is history. So in that spirit, I may have plenty of advice to offer the newlyweds, but I'm just not going to do that. Uh, it would be forever doomed. Uh, but I know they'll figure it out, and I know that fate is on their side, and I'm really just so happy to be a brother to this fantastic couple. I love you guys. And on the last speech show, final toast, Lachaim to the newlyweds, or as my 22-month-old Shane would say, drink time! Lachaim, <laughs> cheers.